Three, check this out. And three, two, one, pop! <laughs> Pretty cool, right? You can try it too Duck! if you... You're getting pretty good at this. You guys are working way too hard. You're always looking to one up us, aren't you? Is one seriously cool temple. Yeah, points for Ivor, I guess. This was a good tip. Well, Jesse? So, are we doing this? Order of the Stone, let's get some treasure. Treasure! treasure! So much for treasure. This cupboard is bare. Come on, you know how these places work. The treasure's never just out in the open. Let's fan out and search the place. would have been disappointed if the floor didn't open up into a dark, creepy passageway. This kind of reminds me of when we first found the Order's Temple. We were such a scared bunch of noobs back then. Hey, I wasn't scared. Wow, yeah, that feels like it was, I don't know, a million years ago. We packed a lot in since then. And to think, that was just the beginning. Yeah. That was before we'd fought wither storms, hung out with Enderman, reunited the Order. So crazy. Bingo! All right, let's see what we've got. It's a cake! Man, this reminds me of that time when you got a cake from that witch's hut, and I was super jealous of you. It's just... I really love cake. Right? Cake is the best! It's totally my favorite. Or a top three, at least. You've got discerning taste, Jesse. I respect that. Huh. A pumpkin. Not bad. I suppose that could be useful if we run into Enderman. And looks like we've got one more thing in here. It's... What did you find? What are you guys talking about? Whoa, that's super cool. I've never seen flint and steel like that before. It's enchanted, it's rare, and now it belongs to Jesse. Ah. Whoa, 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 that's so cool. You gotta try it out. Okay, flint and steel, do your thing. Well, I have definitely never seen flint and steel do that before. Uh-oh. Looks like some monsters have a death wish. So what's the plan? 
If you ask me, it seems like a good time for a secret handshake. Warrior whip, go! Come on, Jesse, make it good. Just like. Whoa! You guys, that was amazing! Okay, okay. It wasn't bad. I tell you guys, doing that never gets old. Woo! Yeah, not too bad. Killing a bunch of monsters, getting sweet treasure. Like that flint and steel thing? You gotta try it again. I'd be curious to see it again, too. Way ahead of you on that one, Axel. Whoa! Whoa. Well, well. Where'd you get the new toy? <laughs> Looks a little, uh, sophisticated for you, Jesse. Order of the losers. Yeah, losers. Ugh, who let you guys out of your cave? Well, well, well. If it isn't Aiden and the Pussycats. That's not our name. So what are you ocelots doing here, anyway? The ocelots were Lucas's gang. We ditched that name just like we ditched him. Yeah, we rebranded. We're the Blaze Rods now. Blaze Rods! Shut up, Gil. Wow, you guys are terrible at naming. That's a dumb name. <laughs> Says the heroes that just called their group the New Order of the Stone. And where's Lucas, huh? The minute the Order decided you were cool... For whatever reason... He wouldn't stop sniffing around you like a tame dog. You take that back! Mmm, no. Hey! Lucas is ten times the guy you are. Petra, just ignore it. They don't know what they're talking about. Lucas is our friend, Jesse. No one talks about our friends like that. You probably think that thing makes you so special. Classic Jesse. You take all the best stuff and never give anyone else a chance. That should have been ours. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Blaze Rod. There's no shame in being second-rate eight, and not everyone can do what the Order of the Stone can. <laughs> well, that's that's just what I expect from someone as small-minded as you, Jesse. Hand over the flint and steel, Jesse. Don't make me ask again. You don't get that one. It's supposed to be mine. <gasps> Some hero you are, Jesse. Fine. What hope do we have when heroes like you are throwing your weight around like this? It's not always going to be this way, though. Come on, you guys. Let's get out of here. Blaze Rod! Ooh, I told you to shut up! Look out, Jesse. 
I don't remember him being that angry before. Wow, us being the new Order of the Stone is really getting to that guy. He's gone crazy. We should be careful. He seems different, scarier. Man, and all because he wanted that flint and steel. What are you going to do with it? Ivor's the one that told us about this temple. He might know something about it. We're bringing it home. It'll be safe there. Finally starting to recognize stuff again. Feels good to almost be home. Cheers to that, friend. I just can't shake what Aiden was saying about us back there. We do get a lot of treasure. And I guess sometimes we might throw our weight around. What? No. Aiden's got a bad case of treasure envy, pure and simple. Yeah, not our fault we're so awesome. I guess so. Well, no matter what Aiden thinks, there's one thing I know. What's that? They think we're awesome. They're back! You guys, they're back! Run! Tell everyone that our heroes have returned! <laughs> yep, New Order of the Stone is back in town. Now that we're back, I'm pretty sure that means it's time to party! Yeah, Jesse! You're my favorite Order member! Welcome back! <laughs> See that? Jesse high-fived me! Me! It actually hurt a little bit. Oh. Wasn't a happy to see us scream. Wow, that's new. It somehow manages to evoke skulls and tentacles. What? Wow, that is one epic build with the lava. Yeah, yeah, and the skull motif. Awesome. awesome. I will never understand your taste. <laughs> Not my fault. Look out! Oh, uh, help! Oh, stop your whining. What are your pathetic injuries in comparison to my majestic tower? Ivor? <sighs> of course. Oh, Jesse, you're back! Don't listen to a word these fools tell you. It's a fire hazard! Man, Ivor, this is really cool. Why, thank you, Jesse. So good to finally see someone with some vision. Jesse, seriously? You can't let him keep this up. Jesse, all I wanted was what any man wants a little house of my own, with loads of lava pouring off it. Ivor, I know you mean well, but your house wants to kill people. Dude, you made a killer house. Exactly! Killer! Sorry, but Ivor's right. People have got to be free to build. <gasps> but that's so irresponsible. Well, we have to tear it down. We can't let that monstrosity stand. <clears throat> it's my house, Jesse. Ivor obviously put a lot of work into his new house. We need to show it the same respect that we would show a house not dripping with lava. Leave it. I'm sure we can find a way to work around it, okay? Long live my lava house. Long live lava! Thanks, Jesse! That's right. Keep walking. Keep walking! Always nice to see a gracious winner. Ha uh ha. -huh. Haven't seen you around in a while. So what can I do for you, Jesse? Ivor, we found something at that temple you told us about. What? You did? <laughs> yes, great to see you again. Let's do lunch. I'll bring the carrots. There's no telling who's listening. Beat me in the treasure room. Ten minutes. And bring the thing you found! Well, if we're going to keep that thing up, we should at least encase the lava in some glass to make it safer. But 
Like, not too safe. Come on, help me collect some sand. And you can make sure that when we make it into glass, it's the right amount of safe. Okay. We'll catch up with you later. Yeah, once we make sure this art gets the respect it deserves. Stay out of trouble, you two. <laughs> you stay out of trouble. Good one. Thanks. Later, guys. Come on, let's go find Ivor. Wow, this place is really shaping up. Whoa, Lucas, I don't believe it. Oh, hey guys, you have some pretty cool stuff in here. Crazy stuff. It's been ages, where were you? Oh, you know, just helping to rebuild and stuff. Witherstorm left a big mess out there. Yeah, a lot of homes got wrecked. That's really good of you to help out like that. You have so many other treasures. Boy, you've sure been busy. Oh, wow. You framed it. I'm him. Yeah. How are you doing? Well, I haven't thought about him since it happened. It's easier that way. Gotcha. Well, if that's working, then that's good. <sighs> okay, guys. I promise I wasn't just here to bum everybody out. I actually came back because I need to tell you something. It's about this weird run-in I had with Aiden. Ugh, I hate that guy. Man, he's such a jerk. I mean, he never stops. He's just been so jealous of you and the rest of the Order ever since you saved the world from the Witherstorm. He's convinced that he was supposed to be a hero. Ever since he took over the Ocelot and the Blaze Rods, it just seems like he's gotten meaner. He's pushing Maya and Gil around. Yeah, when we saw him, he kind of freaked me out. You know, making crazy threats, knocking his own gang around. So what'd you find that got Aiden so excited, anyway? Check it out. Wow. What a weird glow. Yeah, I know. I'm supposed to show it to... You found it! Yeah! Oh! Dude, what's wrong with you? This is the greatest find of our time. I can't believe you're actually... Okay, Spill, what's it do? It proves what I've always suspected. That glow, that enchantment, is the work of a very old group of builders. A group so old that they existed even before the Order of the Stone. Whoa. Wow, so that temple we went to, was that built by these old builders? That's my suspicion. But it's what's inside the temple that interests me even more. You see, if these builders truly existed, and if you found their temple, that means we're one step closer to finding the Eversource. What a beautiful sight. Looks like you came back just in time, Lucas. Did you just make that up? No, I found books, mysterious tomes, referencing it on my travels. Mysterious tomes, huh? The Eversource is said to be an object of incredible power possessed by the old builders. It was some sort of treasure or artifact that gave them an endless supply of precious materials. Think about it, Jesse. That temple must have been its hiding place. Wow. Old builders? You learn something new every day. Well, what are we waiting for, then? We've already been to that temple once. Finding it again will be a snap. Old builders, ever sources, ancient mysteries? You know I'm in. Excellent. I'll pack my adventuring things immediately. Wait, he's coming? Wow, sounds like you guys have a lot to get to. I, uh, guess I'll take nope. off. Nope, you're coming with. I need a buffer between me and Ivor. Let's get moving. This is so exciting. <laughs> Adventure! Lucas, I know it's daytime, but watch our backs, okay? I can't believe we're bringing Ivor with us. I mean, it's nice that he's so excited, but... Ugh, not my top choice for adventuring companion. Hey, you can't argue that when it comes to all this ancient history and treasure, Ivor knows a lot. Sure, that's true. These trees are enormous! I 
love it so much. It just really gets on my nerves sometimes. Remarkable. Look at this architecture. So old. So exquisite. Oh, this is just how I dreamed it would be. Hey, let's not get all enamored with the architecture now. We've got a treasure to find. Wow, it looks so different during the day. Okay, but careful what you touch. There could be traps everywhere. Petra, blonde guy, are you two as excited as I am? I'm not sure that's possible. What? She means that you just seem to be super excited, Ivor. Well, that wasn't there last night. That looks promising. I'm heading up. Fantastic! We'll follow right behind you! Uh, yeah. What he said. So, you think this Eversource thing is up here? Hard to say, Jesse. As the story goes, the old builders feared its potential. Well, that seems promising. Away in a place where it would never. Jesse! What do you see? <gasps> it's some kind of portal? It's just as I'd imagined. That's a weird-looking portal. Have you seen anything like it before? No. The old builders experimented with portals, but this is different from anything I've seen. Here goes nothing. Thanks for bringing this back to me, Jesse. I knew you were good for something. That thing is way bigger and more powerful than you can understand, Aiden. Give it back. Says the person who just got knocked trying to light it. Step aside, Jesse. We're heading through that portal now. Oh, no way! Aiden, you're done. This is where it ends. Fine. Blaze rods! Clear me a path. Follow them. If they get the Eversource, who knows what trouble they'll cause. We're going after Aiden and we're going to take him down. Heavy. I am uh, the proportionate weight for my height. Thank you very much. There you go. Easy now. Yes, thank you. Thank you. Okay, what just happened? How did that portal even work? I suppose much the same way a portal to the nether works, except to an entirely different world. You guys see that? What? I'm starting to think Ivor was right about this being another world. That, right there. Big floating island on the horizon. Oh, wow. I'm really surprised I didn't notice that sooner. The city and the clouds. It almost sounds impossible. I just don't know how we're gonna reach it. Yeah, that's definitely gonna be a problem. I can't believe this. We fall through a portal into another world, and then we can't even go anywhere. I don't suppose anyone packed one of those flying machines. Eh, that's more Olivia's bag. Yeah, I've got nothing. It was worth a shot. I guess we could just settle for a bridge. I don't know. Seems like a long way. Do we have enough blocks? 
I mean, it's really, really far. Yes, very astute, Lucas. Don't be such a worrywart, Lucas. I got this. I think this island is more than large enough for our needs. Yeah, if we dig up this entire island, we should have enough to get us over there. Stop pushing! I'm not pushing! Lucas is pushing! I'm just trying to keep away from the edge! It's all edge! Okay, gang, I think that should do it. Let's make ourselves a bridge. Excellent! Okay, this is our stop. Everybody off. Ivor, seriously? <laughs> Sorry, can't help myself. Your building! I... you... I, I... I don't... Hey, you seen a bunch of punks in matching jackets? Call themselves the Blaze Rods? I'm... I'm... I, I, I'm, I'm sorry, but I, I can't talk to you. Why? You... 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 you were building! Uh, unauthorized building is against the law! Wait, there's a law saying people can't build? Yes, it's forbidden! This... this makes no sense! No sense. That's nuts. Building's pretty important. Everyone should be allowed to do it. I, um... Right? I mean, I'm not crazy, right? Oh, uh, it, this is making me terribly nervous, but uh, first those other outsiders, now you. Other outsiders? Where are uh, they? Uh, uh, they went to the inn. I, I'm sorry, but that's all I know. Wait, 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 come You're back. You're super busy, sorry. And he's gone. Ah, <sighs> darn. I wonder if everyone here is that nervous. <laughs> wow. Incredible. It's unbelievable. Who made it? Whoever it was must have had the Eversource. It's the only explanation for the copious amount of rare materials they used to build it. And when I get my hands on it! Hey, how about you take a massive chill pill and we find it first? Yes, 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 yes! I'm just getting excited. And as crazy as Aiden's been lately, if he gets that thing, it would be bad. Well, if we beat him to it, he won't be able to get his slimy little hands on the thing. We need to find Aiden. He's got our flint and steel and he's up to no good, but we're gonna stop him. He mentioned an inn, right? That seems like our best lead for finding Aiden so far. Agreed. The Blaze Rods already have a head start, so we need to get moving. We don't have any time to lose. Hello! It is nice to meet you! How's it going, Lucas? I'm okay. Just watching these guards. They really mean business. Yeah, I wouldn't mess with them if I were you. And where should I put them? Yes, just give them here. I'll deal with them. Get out of here. Go, go! Uh, why, hello there. What can I do for you? I'm not sure what the custom is where you come from, but uh, here, <laughs> it is considered impolite to stare. Uh, hi, I'm sorry to bother you. Are you Milo? Yes, yes, that's me. A pleasure to meet you. Uh, don't see many new arrivals here in Sky City. Now, what can I do for you, friend? I'm busy, but I can spare a moment for a friendly stranger. I heard you talk to the Blaze Rods earlier. What did they want? Hmm, hmm. Blaze rods, hmm. I... I don't know any blaze rods. You must have been misled. I'm sorry, but it's like I told those other outsiders. I can't help you. Now, please. Hey, this our guy? He tell you where to find the blaze rods? How many of you are there? I told you, I don't know anything. He hasn't told you anything yet? Is he hiding them somewhere? You sure keep saying I don't know anything a lot. Don't lie to me, Milo. That's how bad things happen. Fine, if it will make you leave me alone, 
That Aiden fellow did come talk to me earlier. Wanted to know where the Eversource was. Called it! I just told him what everyone else already knows. The Eversource is in the palace with the Founder. That's all that happened, I swear. What a bunch of creeps. Yes, I wasn't terribly fond of them. So where is Aiden now? The group left for the palace, and I haven't seen them since. Attention! Attention, everyone! Just a moment of your time, please. Emergency meeting attendance is mandatory. Oh, slime blocks. Curious. I wonder what that's all about. Oh, it's the founder. I wonder what this is all about. Yes, I'm nervous being surrounded by so many people. Guys, I think I found the blaze rods. Oh, no. What are they doing? People of Sky City, I'm sorry to pull you from your duties, but something urgent has come to my attention. A crime has been committed. A crime? What kind please, of crime? Please, please remain calm. Earlier today, outsiders built a bridge into our fair city from a distant island. Whether these outsiders know it or not, this is a violation of Sky City's most sacred law. No unauthorized building. Wait, is that you? Are you the bridge builders? Obscene builders! Atrocious! Yeah, I heard all about that stupid law, and it's stupid. A stupid law. Who would even come up with that? Jesse, wherever you are, step forward now. I have already been informed of your identity. I appreciate that you may be ignorant of our laws, but I will warn you, Sky City is small, and I promise that if you try to hide, I will find you. We need to get to that ever source at whatever cost. This is clearly our fastest way into the castle. Am I getting arrested? Wait! Don't be fooled by the Founder's lies. I can help you come up with a plan to get into the palace. Here I am! I built the bridge! Are you crazy? Does she look like she's gonna help us? Sorry, Ivor. I'm going with Milo. Me too. Quick then, follow me! Wait, wait! I'm hey, coming hey, peacefully! That's them! They're getting away! After them! Jesse, run! Get run! Oh. I think she's over there! Come on! Where are you going? Let's get him! Where'd they go? Just in here, yes. There's nowhere to hide in here. It's a dead end. Before I take you to any further, you must take an oath. I think they went this way. You must swear to never reveal what I'm about to show you. What? Do you swear that? You can't let them get away. Uh, yeah, sure, whatever. Can we please get on with it? Oh, not quite an oath, but it'll have to do. Philippe? Right this way. This is Build Club. Whoa. Everything you see before you was built from resources that my people have saved or uh, obtained. Man, can't be easy to come by some of this stuff. Nice work. Wow, this is quite the secret hideout, Milo. Very nice. <clears throat> it is not a hideout. It is a Build Club. You see, one day, a long time ago, I was just a citizen of Sky City, like any other. I wanted to make a community garden, so I put in a petition for a dirt block, and mercy me, it was granted. But in my excitement and haste to build my garden, I accidentally dropped my new block, and it fell right over the edge. For my crime, I was tossed into the Founder's dungeons. And I was in there for a very, very long time. Wait, you just dropped some dirt. What was the crime? The crime, Jesse, was the egregious wasting of resources. 
You see, in our world, when something falls over the edge, it is gone forever. But I have always believed in my heart that just because building is risky, it doesn't mean that no one should do it. If only I had known you were builders sooner, I would have helped you all escape when I first met you, rather than let your friends be taken. But at least you are here, yes? I would like to save Lucas. And Ivor, I guess. You said something before about having a plan, a different way into the palace to save our friends? Yes, I did say that. Hey, Milo! Ah, hello, my friends. Bringing in outsiders? Seriously? Pretty hard to keep this a secret club if you just bring people in. Yeah, we have it hard enough as it is. Everyone, please! Yeah, it's hard enough without you bringing in a couple of randos. Uh, you want to get out of our faces, pal? What did you say to me? You heard, Jesse. Back off! Whoa, 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 whoa! Hang on, hang on. I swear, they're cool. These aren't just any outsiders. They're the ones who built that magnificent bridge into town today! What? Dude! Milo, jeez! Milo! Are you kidding me? The most wanted criminals in the whole city? We gotta turn them in before the guards break our door down. Well, no, let's not do that. I assure you, harboring them is worth the risk. They are the epitome of Build Club material. Builders, I'm not sure. They say them builders. Perhaps a challenge? All right, then. If Milo says you're these amazing builders, prove it. Yeah, build something. Now, see here, this is all highly disrespectful to my guests. I'm the leader here. I think I know my way around a crafting table better than any of you chumps. Oh, cocky. Let's see if you can back that up. We don't know many recipes, so if you just show us something that they build where you come from. You're gonna be just fine, Jesse. Jesse, it took us many weeks to scrape together this inventory. Please. Use them for your build. build oh, thanks. Let's see here. Anyone got something to take notes with? No. Darn. I guess I'll just have to try to remember all this then. Jesse, what is that thing? Is it, is, is it safe? Oh no, everyone, it's an iron golem and it's out of control. Run for your lives. Or do Remember me as I was. <laughs> Jesse. What? Hey, everyone, calm down. There's nothing to worry about. I can understand why the guards are after you. I mean, that was awesome. Right? I told you. Yeah, we're really sorry. Wowzers. So sorry. <sighs> yeah, sorry. we're sorry. Hey, these things happen. Apologies totally accepted, dudes. Now, uh, how about that whole getting us into the palace thing? Yeah, that would be great. Ah, yes, of course, of course. That is, after all, why you are here. I must say, though, after seeing you in action, your skills are even more impressive than I could have imagined. So impressive that I wonder if I could implore you for a tiny favor. What kind of favor? I help you get into the palace. You help me steal the Eversource for my people. Unlimited resources for everyone! Are you kidding? We had a deal, Milo. You can't keep changing it yeah, around. you said you'd help us. And I am helping you. You just need to know, this is the deal. Fine. Now, as for how to get into the palace, according to my informants, the founder keeps the Eversource behind a secret door located in her throne room. Dramatic. Every night, the founder leaves guards at every door, but there's a single window at the back of the palace that is left unguarded. It's an almost perfect point of entry, but it is far too high. <laughs> if we can find a way through that window, the Eversource would be practically within our grasp. Okay, so we'll just climb up. That doesn't seem too hard. You have not seen this wall. We have tried, but it is sheer steel blocks. No handholds. 
means you guys need to start thinking like builders out there. We're gonna make a ladder. Building ladders? Craft a way in? If you could show us how to craft something that would reach the window, we could get this heist underway. Jesse, we will never forget this day. Okay, my friends. This should take us right into the throne room. Once inside, we will just need to find the secret entrance that the founder supposedly uses. Isn't it exciting? On our way to changing everything! Freeing the Eversource for the people! Milo, pipe down! There are guards down there! Right, right, right. My apologies. I'm just so excited. Actually, out in the field, applying ladders to a wall! Here. Yeah, I know. I know. Why are you saying things to me that I already... Whoa! Whoa. Jesse! Jesse! Hatra! Boy, am I glad to see you guys. Right back at ya. What are the odds? Am I right? Lucas, Ivor, we're here to rescue you. I think you're a little late for that. <laughs> yeah, we broke out ourselves. It's a good thing you guys are here. Aiden's going after the Eversource. Which we obviously can't abide! We're here to get it first! Fantastic! That is what we are doing as well. Who, uh, who's this guy, by the way? I mean, I assume he's cool, right? Lucas Ivor, this is Milo. He's the leader of an underground rebellion. Wow. That's pretty cool. A pleasure. Yeah. Hi. Sure. The Founder's secret entrance is supposed to be somewhere in this throne room. If it's in here, we'll find it. I'm getting a very door vibe from this. Yeah. What happened to it? Just need to make something to activate that redstone circuit again. There's gotta be something in here we can use. Like a lever. If you can find one of those bad boys, we'll have that secret door open in a snap! Poor dead bush. Barely more than a bundle of sticks. Hopefully no one will miss one dead bush. Perfect. Huh. <gasps> A cobblestone generator. Amazing! Lava and water. Placed exactly far enough that when they collide, it creates cobblestone. Genius! Ingenious. Yeah, and it should be just the thing to make a lever with that stick I found. Okay, let's do this. Ah, my old friend the lever. Fantastic! Wow. Didn't know you were watching. My apologies. It is still just such a thrill to see someone so confident and sure in their building abilities.
Whatever source, here we come. Chests. Yeah, and they're all labeled? Creeper, zombie, sheep, pigman. Curious. But what does it mean? Huh. Eggs? The sign says sheep, not eggs. Might as well throw it and give it a shot? A sheep? Is... is that a monster? That is not so bad. It is fluffy. The eggs all have creatures inside them. And they're all different colors. They must be, you know, color-coded what's in them. So she can just spawn things whenever she wants to. So this must be where the resources come from. Different monsters and creatures, different drops. Stay on your toes! We're close! Ah! I can't wait! Let's take a look around. Pretty weird. What? The Eversaurs. It's just a chicken. So the chicken lays the eggs, and the eggs make monsters, and the loot from the monsters made this place. Well, throw it in the minecart and let's get out of here. We're still taking it, right? The chicken that the entire city depends on? Are you sure that's a good idea? What are you talking about? We need to bring it to the people. With it, we'll finally be free of the founder. But that clucking thing is what we came for. Hey, I'm with you, Ivor. Let's grab it and get out of here. Ah! Adventure! Dude, seriously? I knew it. I knew you were here to steal from me. She's too fast. Take it, you're... Says the trespassing criminal. It's just like I told you, Founder. They're here to steal the Eversource. Classic Order of the Stone. You don't say. What? No! Don't believe that! No, 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 no. You don't get to spit it like this, Aiden. You're the bad guy. You just expect me to believe a bunch of criminals? Aiden warned me that you were a pack of thieves, and here you are, prepared to make off with the one thing our city depends on to survive. Boy, when you put it like that, I almost feel bad. Yep, afraid I'm going to be taking the chicken. It's mine now. What? This is outrageous. Aiden, don't do this. Somebody order eggs. This is all your 
Thanks to you, we get to see what really happens when you fall off the islands. Hey, you can't pin this on me. This is your fault. Are you serious? Yeah, I'm serious. Trusting the blaze rods, hiding the Eversource, I didn't do any of that. Hmm, I can't decide whether I want our death to be painless for my sake or excruciating for yours. Land! Impossible. That's impossible. Jesse? There! Can we get to it in time? It's gonna be close! I don't believe it. Wow, so guess you were wrong, huh? About there being no ground. I had no idea. How... how could I have known? <sighs> mm. This has been down here the whole time. I forbade anyone to look for land below us. Well, land is gonna be a pretty big game changer for you guys. I mean, it's gonna change everything. Yes. It's all just so enormous. Just just grass everywhere. I can barely process what I'm seeing. What what do I do now? Once my people see this, I You can bring all your people down here. They won't they won't have to, to petition for resources or any of that stuff anymore. I I suppose you're right. Yes, we have to go back up and tell them. Getting back up. My word, you're right. We need to do that. I hadn't even thought that far ahead yet. Look out! What's going on up there? Aiden must be going crazy with those spawn eggs. Monsters everywhere? This is gonna be bad. I can't leave my subjects in whatever trouble they're in. Jesse, will you please help me get back to Sky City? Stop Aiden! My poor subjects. This is terrible! I'm doing it, but not for you, for my friends. I... yes, yes, of course. Thank you, Jesse. Okay, getting back up. Getting back up. Let's see what we've got to work with. Hmm, that'll work. What is it? Get ready to build the tallest thing you ever built. What? We're gonna build a tower of dirt all the way back up to Sky City. Grab as much dirt as you can carry. Oh, okay. That should do it. Jesse, what is that? Once I get my flint and steel back from the blaze rods, it'll be my ticket out of here. We've got a city to save. You ready? I believe so. And when I get up there, I'm going to tear those blaze rods limb from limb.
monsters! Help me! He needs our help! What is going on here? The city is under attack by monsters, ma'am. Everywhere! They seem to be coming from inside the palace itself! Come on, we need to stop him! I'm sorry, Jesse, but I have to save my people. Take care of yourself out there, okay? And to you as well. Jesse, you're alive! Please, can you help us? Hang tight, Milo. quick on your feet. But with all seriousness, how are you alive? I saw you go over the edge. Okay, quick version. You know how you all thought there was nothing but void below you? Yes. Yeah, that was wrong. There's land. <gasps> you speak truthfully, my friend? <sighs> well, I can't wait to hear all about it later. I gotta get to the palace. Thank you, my friend. We'll see you on the other side. <laughs> how do you like that, huh? Blade rods! Boom! Hey! Jesse! You're alive? <gasps> Aiden has taken over the palace. He's holed up in the throne room, throwing those spawn eggs everywhere. No one can get inside! We need to stop him. I know. Jesse, take one of these. They're all locally sourced and handcrafted. I use only the best ingredients. Got any potions of invisibility? Here! Can't stop what you can't see. <laughs> and get out of my face, Reggie! You're delusional, Aiden! The people of Sky City will never bow to you! You killed the Founder! Yeah? Aiden, you've lost! I saw you fall! You went down! You're alive! You're alive! Is the Founder with you? Ah! I heard... <laughs> what the... Reginald! Not one more step! I killed you once! I could do it again! Just you and me, Aiden. Just you and me now. Just... die already! Should have left while you had the chance! Someone else in the spotlight, can you? You just can't let anyone else win. It just drives you crazy to see someone else succeed, doesn't it? Aiden, I am gonna kick your butt. I can't wait to see you try.
Wait, hang on, hang on. I, I, I surrender. I surrender. We can talk about this, right? Here, here. You want your flint and steel back, huh? Take it. It's yours. Just please, don't hurt me. You did it, Jesse. We need to get out of here. What do you want to do with him? Please! This place is getting worse by the minute! You can't just leave me here! Take me with you! After everything you've done, I'm not sure you deserve that kind of mercy. Leave him. He made his bed, he can lie in it. What? No! You can't just... How dare you! Stop ignoring me! Where's Aiden? We heard the fighting. We fought and he fell down one of these waterfalls. Well, what goes around comes around, I guess. You retrieved the Eversource. Yes, ma'am. Everyone, stay together! Jesse, there you are! Jesse. The situation is getting out of hand. We simply can't stop all the monsters and protect my people. The longer we stay here, the more danger my people will be in. We need to get out of here. The waterfalls. The waterfalls can take us to safety. What? Are you crazy? The waterfalls will just take us into the void. We'll die if we fall down there. But there's nothing but monsters up here. Do you want to die? Because that's what's going to happen if you stay up here. Everyone just watch me and follow my lead, okay? Jesse has done nothing but help us so far. I will show you just how much I believe in Jesse's word. Thank you enough. You've saved us all. So what do we do now? Everything's just so different. Well, let me tell you, Reggie. The first thing you need to do is go get yourself some wood. How, uh, how do I do that? You find a tree and then you just start punching. Uh, uh, I wonder what happened to Aiden. Stop right there! You're not going anywhere, Aiden. I'm done. I'm done. Now, this is just speculation, but I'm guessing they have some regrets. I knew they wouldn't get away. <laughs> what goes around comes around, am I right, guys? Attention! Attention! Hello, hello, everyone, please. This is your founder speaking. 
Now that we're all safe, we need to organize. Start planning our new community. Are you listening to yourself? That's insane! We were prisoners long enough on that island in the sky. It is time for us to run free! Build whatever we please! Wow! Those two just cannot get along. Jesse, I cannot allow my people to be influenced by this naive idealist. Milo, come on. The Founder's trying to help. It's true. Help herself right back into her own throne, more like. No, you don't understand. It will be night soon, and that is when the monsters come out. If we don't prepare, we'll be in danger. You're just making excuses to control our behavior, just like before. We must trust in ourselves, be able to learn from our mistakes. The people need to build! W what do we do? Who are we supposed to listen to? Guys, Milo is right. You need to take risks. If you don't, You'll just keep doing the same safe things over and over again, and you'll never grow, you'll never live. But what if we die? Okay, I won't lie to you. You could die, but doesn't that make it even more awesome? No, wait, please. It's dangerous. Well, my friend, this is truly the beginning of a new era. Your deeds will be remembered around here for a long, long time to come. Many years from now, we will still reminisce about the great things that Jesse did. Just try and play nice with the Founder, okay? I know you don't always get along, but her heart's in the right place. Well, my friend, it looks like this is where I must bid you farewell. I have a lot of work ahead of me now, and I can't wait to start. Thank you again. <laughs> I'm gonna miss that crazy guy. I guess we should prepare for Nightfall too. Without another portal, we're stuck here. Been a while since I've had to start from square one. That would be the case, but luckily you had me as your advanced scout. When I was on the ground with the founder before I totally found the portal. And you didn't say anything? Yeah. I'm actually gonna have to agree with Ivor on this one. I guess the moment just never presented itself. Come on. Oh, hi. Ah, oh, there you are. I'm so sorry about her. That's okay. Looks like she's having fun running around. Yes, I think she took it pretty well when I told her she didn't need to be the Eversource anymore. What are we gonna do with you now, huh? What are you going to do now? Besides continue to be adorable, of course. <laughs> but that was a given. You're not gonna eat her, are you? Don't be morbid, of course not. After so long being the Founder and the Eversource, now we can just be Isa and her best friend. Benedict. Ah, that's a boy's name. Huh, what a closed-minded attitude. Jesse, I would be honored if you would take this as a small token of our gratitude. Thank you. Come along, Benedict. We have a lot of adventures ahead of us. Well, there goes the Eversource. Off to cluck and peck at seeds for the rest of its valuable life. Hey, Jesse. You okay? Jesse? Yeah, I'm fine. Come on, let's head home. See? Just like I told you. One portal back home. Whew, what a huge relief. I was worried we'd be stuck here forever. Ugh. I just can't wait to put this whole world behind us. Oh, is someone being grumpy? No! A little. I was just hoping for a real treasure is all. <laughs> oh, stocks, no proper treasure. Although I wonder what would happen if you put that tiny crown on a different chicken. Come on, guys. Let's go home. We don't Axel and Olivia here where we've been. They'll never believe it. That's... Not what I was expecting. <laughs>